This is Twit. It is the season, uh, of course. <laughs> to cook your spacecraft. Well, that's right, right? Where you're having lots of holiday roasts and NASA's going to do it with the Parker Solar Probe. And for uh, for the first time ever, we're about to get our closest, uh, get up close and personal with the sun um, on Christmas Eve. So just when everyone's sitting down for, for dinner, we usually have tamales at my house, actually. Uh, uh, NASA is going to fly by and making its closest approach with the Parker Solar Probe. Ars Technica has this really good uh, story uh, about how we're going to fly, quote unquote, inside the sun for the first time. And some background here. The Parker Solar Probe is NASA's most ambitious uh, and uh, an intrepid uh, mission to the sun ever. It's been slowly getting closer and closer and closer to the sun uh, with a series of flybys that flew by Venus a couple times, I think, uh, etc., so that it can touch basically like the surface, that photosphere kind of gaseous, those layers, you know, because it's not like a rock or whatever, the sun. Um, So that we can understand like what makes it tick. And on uh, December 24th, I think it's like at six in the morning, it's really early Eastern time. uh, It's going to fly within um, 6.1 million kilometers. So that's 3.8 million miles. Remember, we're like what, 92, 93 million miles away from the sun uh, on the earth. So very, very close by. And it's going to uh, withstand temperatures of up to like 2,500 degrees, which is crazy. And the goal is to basically understand how this sun uh, has been changing over time, you know, get this up close, like how its uh, weather is behaving, uh, how everything uh, in terms of like the, the, the heat dynamics are all working. So we can understand how these stars work and hopefully make sure they don't fry us all with solar storms. And, uh, and it's, just, it's just really amazing. It has this huge thick plate on the front as like a heat shield uh, to hopefully it will survive. In fact, as you and I are recording this, Rod and uh, Anthony, uh, they are lo- like getting their last signal from Parker Solar Probe until it flips around the other side. So it's going to go dark, for at least signal-wise, for the next like week or so, until December 27th, really. Uh, and that's when they're going to find out, one way or another, if the spacecraft survived like this super close uh, 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 flyby of the sun. So very exciting stuff. Uh, of course, we're not going to know one way or another for another week until after Christmas, so maybe we'll have a nice belated Christmas present. I just dropped my mouse on the floor. I hope you didn't hear that. So- <laughs> <laughs> I swear, the chair break or the mouse drop is. Yeah, yeah I fixed the chair. <laughs> remembered the chair. <laughs> I fixed I it. I bought extra weeks. parts and I put a new bottom on it, and it doesn't even wibble, wibble wobble anymore. So and Aunt, you wouldn't believe the amount of drama with it. We're going back and forth. He's saying, "I don't know where to get the parts, and if I get them, well, what do I do? And how do I?" And I said, "Just get the new air piston for it." They saw that. No, no, it's not that. It's a thing, and all that. And I said, "Okay." bolt some wooden blocks to the foot struts it'll be oh fine. we had that for a while yeah oh um, i can't do that all right <laughs> let's uh let's roll to a break before i say something to embarrass I, I had a question about this oh Can yes questions about this no yes yes, yes. okay all right jeez so um you said it's gonna flip around is that What's the point of it flipping around? Oh, so I mean, when it comes around the other side, basically when it finishes oh, okay. the flyby, it's 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 going, uh, it's so close to the sun and it's such a harsh environment that it's mm-hmm. not going to be able to get the signals out because it's facing, it's okay. like all hunkered down basically for this 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 flyby. It has like a small uh, instrument package, about 110 pounds of of instruments on board that it's wow. going to be recording all of the information and stuff of the sun. But today, it's I like think the that's last a little insulting. Here. What? Telling Parker that it has a small package. I just oh, don't just, think that's great. Right. <laughs> it's a huge spacecraft, multi-billion dollar spacecraft. Oh, okay. We, we can only get this, this these bits there. So I, I'm curious to see how they tested it if it's rated to be able to withstand that much heat. You a know? great big blow toward it. Well, and what's interesting is so the shield is uh, I don't know. It's a combination of graphite and carbon composites, a bunch of other stuff, right? Mm-hmm. Dark, yeah. but. It's, you know, it it can forestall heat from that direction. But if I recall, the photosphere itself is very hot. It's not just, you know, what's coming to the surface of the sun with illumination. It's actually the photosphere itself. So the whole thing has to be somewhat armored. Right. Uh, What temperature is it exposed to at its peak, do you know? Well, they they, they said 25, up to 2,500 degrees is what they said. Um, And 
That's hot. I think, I, I mean, yeah, it's pretty hot. It's like it's like reentry. They they basically put it inside with like a jet engine thing, like a supercharged rocket engine. Okay. And then just turned it on and said, "All right, did we cook it? <laughs> no, no. All right, it's fine. All right, good, good for I the sun." So roll that thing out with these little smoking tendrils coming off of it. Oh, let's go back. Okay. But, now, but now it, let's... it is going. It is going fast though. It's going to be going like one percent the speed of light because of the acceleration, like four hundred and. 30,000 miles an hour. That's really, really fast. So, Hey, if you enjoyed this clip, be sure to check out This Week in Space. You can find us on your favorite podcast app or see the link in the description below. See you there. <laughs>